Hey everybody, Rick Needham handicapping thoroughbred racing from the Del Mar Thoroughbred Club on Thursday afternoon, August the 25th, and this is my Equibase Winter Circle Southern California race of the day. Let's take a look at race 7 this afternoon, folks, 5 o'clock p.m. Pacific post time. It's an 11 furlong route test on the turf. Three-year-olds and up race for an optional claiming purse of some $65,000. Contenders number 9, Scorpion time. Number 7, Tifatile. Number three, a Cordoro, and number eight, Isle of Prado. Number nine, Scorpion Time, is both the overall speed and pace profile leader in this optional claiming field, racing at or about today's distance 11 furlongs on the turf. Has hit the board in power run fashion in four straight starts, including a power run win facing better company. It's the last time out. Jockey Joseph Talamo and trainer Michael Makowski send him post route. They've hit the board with an even 50% of their entry saddle as a team to date. Number 7, Tifatlie, a 12 to 1 bomb, also has good overall speed for this route test on the grass, drops in class, has produced a quartet of power runs in his last five starts. Race 7 summary, number 9, Scorpion Time, tops the contenders list, which also includes number 7, Tifatlie, number 3, Accordoro, and number 8, Isle of Prado, 9738 in the 7th today from Del Mar. Bonus long shots, River Downs, race 7, the 9 to 2 shot. Number 2, Gamble for Money. Speed figures sprinting at her about today's distance of 6 furlongs on the dirt, which are equivalent to the favorite. Number 7, Classy Corbin. Canterbury Park, race 2, the 6 to 1 shot. Number 8, Mingo Ace. Takes a class drop with 8 units as the overall speed leader in this claiming field. Racing at or about today's distance of seven and a half furlongs on the turf. So from Del Mar on a Thursday, Rick Needham for the Equibase Winter Circle reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.